Mr. Farage, there are some criticism about this new Polish MEP who is, uh, who is said to be very extremist in his country. What do you say about him? Everybody makes compromises. I mean, look at the socialist group. I mean, there was a Croatian socialist party held a rally with openly homophobic comments. Uh, the ECR group have a guy within it with a conviction, a racial conviction. So there are all sorts of compromises that are being made. It's a question of how far you go. Our group, despite Mr. Schultz's attempt to destroy it, is still alive. But these MEPs said that sometimes he's right to, to beat women, if I'm not wrong. Well, you know, he said that was an ironic, sarcastic comment uh, made made, frankly, as a joke um, and that it should not be taken seriously. And that's one of the problems in politics. If you do make, you know, off the cuff, aside comments, they can be taken literally. Front National said that they refused to, to start negotiations with him and that it's just opportunism uh, from your yeah. part yeah. talk with these Polish MEP. You're confusing two things. Uh, one is the leader of the party who has said some outrageous things. The other is this individual MEP. They are two different things. Are, are not you afraid that uh, your group is still not solid as there are delegations made by just one MEP, as Poland, for example? This is difficult. You know, we are in, look, let's be honest, we're in a, you know, we are in a very difficult position um, and we're in a parliament where we're massively outnumbered by people who think the Euro and the European project has democratic legitimacy. We don't think that. Um, and, and so, you know, it, this is not easy. Are you in favour of the death penalty? No, I'm not myself.